Okay. Disaster time, as I thought. I thought there was a little leak somewhere in the bathroom. And sure enough, we've now got a bulging ceiling. So I'm going down, heading down now to find out what's caused it and whether we can solve it. Oh my God, I hate plumbing, the bathroom, water, electricity, houses, walls, sockets, drilling, scraping, and all the rest of it. <laughs> I'll see you in there. Oh, shine a light. Yeah, look at that. Oh, boy. Depends where it's coming from and where it's running to. Do you want me to show you the bathroom? Yes, let's go see the bathroom. So, I'll show you what I found. I've tried to rip up some floorboards to get a proper look. And it is just blue. Oh, it's So good. Do you know, I've got no smell and I was thinking I this stinks. couldn't smell a thing. But I thought it must be just me. That's the thing. Right. Check this. I don't want to. Oh no. And it goes all the way back. So I don't know. Move oh, those out. Take okay. those out. Slide them out. Just be careful. It's not. I couldn't see anything there and I couldn't yeah. see anything out. I could only see it here. Yeah. So, I don't know how we're going to get under the sink because I think this one is screwed in, but it, I don't know. I'll see if it, if it comes out. How the heck we fix this in? It's somewhere back here.
I'm not, I'm pushing it into the wall. Whoever designs basins, put the bloody hole where you screw it on the outside. I don't care if you can see it, at least then you can get your hands in to do it. But these morons design it round the back. It's like having your front door to your house on the roof. Stupid. Bloody stupid. All right. Big review. Right. Something is leaking. Right. Yeah, that's not. That's not. What the hell? Is it just the condensation from this? No. Can't be. No. Jeez. Can't be. What's that? Leaking? It's there. It's, this is sopping here under the basin. All right. This one under the basin somewhere. Right, you've turned. I turned the water off. I just straight up went to the thing, tap, and turned it off. Yeah. Have you got a. Right, go. I need a, a flathead screwdriver. You can turn that off. Is that what's dripping down? I think it's, um... Yeah. Yeah. It's all water feed. No, hot water feed. It's just empty. Oh! Bugger! Oh right, well... What it means, Matthew. Yeah. You got no hot water. For the sink? For the sink. Okay. At the moment. What was it like? What was it like? You can see. Can you see the nut? Right, and I'm guessing that's really difficult to tighten. Yeah, it's getting in there to put the pressure on. I had to take it off before and do it. And I, and now it's screwed on to the wall. And now it's glued on, screwed on, and everything else on. Right. Okay. So that is what is known as a problem. Awkward. But at least we know. You see, it must have dried off in the time it took. Yeah, it has. Because you turned it off. Mm. You know. But how's that getting into like there? Into where? Yeah. Because it's, it's just dried, soaked, tracked along the plaster. And then there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so from up in here, up there, dribbles down. It's kind of <coughs> tracked underneath in there. 
come across here and you can see the joist. Nice. So we now need to kind of spray that. So I'm going to have to go back and fix that stupid sink. God, it's dribbled the connection. I've used PTFE tape. Uh, I, I just don't know if, if the connection of the flexible hose up to the tap is good enough, but it's caused a real problem. It's, uh, oh, so that's going to have to dry out. Uh, I have to use a bit of fungicidal spray to get rid of the mold and things that it's caused. I'm going to have to see if I can get rid of the silicon around the edge of the sink so I can lift it off so I can undo uh, not happy however we'll get there but we're just going to that's going to be it for today disastrous anyway i'll see you very soon as we escape to the dream house it is a dream house it will be it is a dream house yeah it just needs a little bit more love and care all right see you soon